Hi guys, welcome to Luke's Bug Adventures. And look at this amazing diamatic display by my male spiny flower mantis. Look, what's a diamatic display? A diamatic display is when they put up their wings. They can only do it when they're adults. They put up their wings and it looks like they have a bunch of different colors. Oh, and now he's relaxed again. But I can't bring him <laughs> back up and they I do it that. because when they're threatened they want to make them as big as possible Absolutely. and this guy he just like when i took him out of the container he just went in mad mode <laughs> is he but he's not mad anymore no he thought yeah. you were a predator they always yeah, think that they spiny always, flowers always have yeah, a lot when of when i character. say mad i mean he's just a little spooked out yes definitely so this is our male should we show our female Spiny yes. flower, these are the ones that you made it, I think. Yes, I did make these. Yay. Things. So this is where, uh, this is where um, uh, some of um, Emily's um, uh, babies came from. Yes. Emily's uh, All spiny All the babies. subscribers that are also subscribed to Snake Discovery, thank you so much. You have blown our minds in like one hour. Thank you. Thank you so much, and we will keep posting daily. Maybe not daily, but we'll post a lot of fun mantis videos. <laughs> daily would mean you couldn't go to school. Oh, yeah. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Look at how cute he is. Let me get the female. Oh, you're getting the female? Okay. The female. She might be a little feistier. Yeah. Luke is getting the female. Yeah, she's a little feisty. Okay. Fine. This is the female, and she is about six, month old, uh, six months old, I, I want to say. Five or six. Yeah, five yeah. or six months. And, uh, and she's in her mad diamatic display. Spiders tend to do that a lot. They do. And when I say mad, I really just mean that they've been a little spooked, and they put up that threat display. And um, if you turn this around, you can this way. This way, so you can actually show everyone the eye spots. Yes. So what are the eye spots for? The eye spots are so... Uh, oh, she's putting that back there up. There you go. Nice. The eye okay, spots... So hold it steady. ...are so it looks like something is spying on a predator that might be trying to eat this mantis. So they go away because they don't want to be seen. They almost look like owl eyes, don't you They think? really do. Yeah. I mean, that yellow... I mean, when you actually look from under here... It's actually a bright yellow. I see yeah, that. Yeah, there's her abdomen right there. But when you look at it from here, under... On the other side, yeah. It's bright yellow. I do see that. Here, let me just tilt this. Can you do that one? There we go. Definitely looks like um, a predator's watching. Yes. And usually um, for animals, the defense is that if you can look like a predator or if you yes. can look like you're watching... The predator come? Yes, the, definitely. Then what's the predator more likely to do? It's more likely to run away. Absolutely. So you are smart, smart mantis. Very smart. Yeah. So this is where we got Emily's, um, uh, this is, she's the one who laid the oot yeah, and then we got Emily's is. nymphs? Yes. Nice. Oh, our spiny is showing a threat display. Oh, He's wow. so cute. You're mad. <laughs> what were you going to talk about the origins of the spiny flower? Where are they usually found in nature? So the spiny flower mantis is found in the sub-Saharans of Africa. The desert areas, right? Yes. And they eat just about anything. They're the fiercest eaters I can ever imagine. For and their size. I oh, mean, our wow. sweetie pie is about an inch and a half long with... 10 inches of attitude, I would say, wouldn't yeah, you? Yeah, 10 inches of Hi, attitude. Hi, sweetie pie. Hi. So what do we usually feed our spiny flowers? We usually feed them uh, moths and flies, but in the wild, they eat everything you could think of. Definitely. And you can also feed them very safe crickets as long as yes. the crickets are clean. Yes. You see? He's still moving around. I'm getting even more mad. <laughs> and your, uh, your female has calmed down. Let me see if we can... Show people those purple eyes because they do retain those as adults. Yes. They're like, what color would you call those? Purple. Yes, definitely. Hi, sweetie. Emily and Ed said the same thing. They love the purple eyes mm -hmm. and will definitely send them many, many more spiny flowers. Absolutely. Why don't you put your hand down here where it's steady and I will um, show them the flower legs. So what do the legs remind us of? Look um, those. They remind me of a stick. Definitely. <laughs> a yeah. really thin stick. The whole look of them looks like a flower, and their legs sort of look like a petal with a blue or a green and white pattern. They seem to have a lot of pink also. They do. Look at that. 
So now, is our spiny flower here with the wings, is she an adult, honey? Yes, yeah, she is a full-grown adult. Uh, she was paired with this male, actually, mm -hmm. uh, who is currently still mad. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, everything went well. We have to keep the females uh, fed while they're pairing, especially spiny flowers, because they are very fierce. And I, and I know this sounds a little harsh, but the males sometimes can eat the female. And sometimes the females will also eat the males. Yeah. Yes, males and females in the spiny flower world are very, very fierce. But look, how, is the, how are they to handle if you're a human being? They are so fun and easy, especially when they get mad. They're not going to hurt you no, at all. Not a, not they a, might try to strike at you a little bit, but it's so cute that it I doesn't know. even hurt. No, it doesn't feel like anything, yeah. but the attitude is what we love about yeah. them. And in terms of their care, how easy or difficult is it to take care of a spiny flower mantis? Spiny flowers, they're such fierce eaters. They are very hardy, and they're one of the top five easiest beginner mantises to Agreed. raise. Agreed. What's one thing um, that you shouldn't do with a spiny flower? You should not over mist them. Right, because, with water. Yes, because, you know, they live in the desert, and they, of course, need water because they're a living thing, but they don't need too much. No. And what kind of water do we use? We use um, either distilled water or reverse osmosis. You can also use well water if you have a clean source. Definitely. And so, look, honey, the nymphs are so different from the mom and dad adults, right? Yes. What's the fun thing about a nymph? When they are first born, they're ants. They literally look like ants. Seriously, so jet tiny. black. Jet black, and they move around like this. <laughs> you can see one of our old Instagram videos, and it looks just like this, and you can see them as a little ant. I know. What are you doing, honey? Um, well, just a minute ago, I, told, I wanted to tell you that spiny flowers will dance with you. If you start dancing like this with them, this girl just flapped her wings like she was trying to fly. <laughs> they also do that so they can rearrange them uh, if they get a little misplaced. The wings? Yes. So she was dancing with you? Yes. And they just flutter their wings up like they're trying to fly even though they're not going to. And when they're little, they do like a, like when they're black... Uh, ant shape they yeah. do like a very particular dance right yeah. like what is that dance robot dance the robot dance do do um spiny flowers and mantises have antenna yes they do it's those little lines up there that are curled and they also have um some yellow blotches i see that yeah So what's that, honey? Um, this is the abdomen, which is also the butt, where the poop gets produced. Right. And that's um where they actually breathe from. They breathe from their butt. Oh, yes. So what was your joke about the mask? If a mantis had to wear a mask, where would it logically wear it? Where would it logically wear it, honey? On its face, right? But they actually had to wear it on their butt because they breathe through their butt. Thank oh. you, Danny Terrakoff, for making that joke. <laughs> <laughs> you think it gets kind of stinky down there? Yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. Thank you so much for watching this book Adventures, and it really means a lot to us for you to subscribe and for you to uh, follow us on Instagram. Thank you so much, and a humongous shout out to Emily and Ed at Snake Discovery. Thank you so much for supporting me on YouTube and Instagram, especially Emily and Ed from Snake Discovery. Thank you so much. You, you, we never thought you would do this for us. This is our whole mantis room, and there will be many more mantis videos coming out. So stay tuned. There might even be another one today. <laughs> what do we say to our friends watching? Thank you for watching Loose Bug Adventures. And remember, every day is a, a new mad spiny day. Bye!